All right, guys, quick P365 X macro uh, life hack, if you will. It's going around. I saw it on YouTube. Guy's name, I think, is Cornholio. Um, so you got your standard 17-round 17 17-round 17 mag. Uh, you got your 15-round. Here I got the little spacer on it for uh, the XL. Well, if you take the spacer off, you can buy, if you don't have any laying around, uh, the 12-round floor plates from SIG. Uh, there's a little bit of a, well, it's not really, a, yeah, I guess there's a little bit of a shelf in the back. Uh, if you take a Dremel, Dremel it down, you'll be able to uh, slide it over the back, see if I can get this for the camera. You can kind of see where maybe I took just a little bit too much off back there. Um, but yeah, they work fine and uh, they fit in the gun fine. So stick out a little bit little bit a little bit of a gap another thing you can do i think the same guy did it is he took this sleeve and he matched the angle here and he cut this down uh to make it fit so that there's you don't have that little gap there's a few other people coming out with base pads uh that'll just replace whatever you got on there and it'll match it who knows how much that's going to be uh these were like six bucks uh from sig uh picked up a few of them filed it back down with a dremel no dramas. Uh, I just use them for range mags because I'm carrying in the gun and a spare in my pocket, 17. So uh, just a quick life hack for you guys who uh, may have picked up an X macro or like I did just the X macro frame and some 17 round mags and had a bunch of 15s lying around. All right, guys, train hard, stay safe. See you in the range.